New at noon, we are hearing from Congresswoman Debbie Dingell on the possible threats on the U.S. Capitol. We know that there are people that want to kill members of Congress. That is a documented threat. I think if you're a woman from Michigan, uh, you've become used to the kind of hatred that can be targeted at you, and we all take it seriously, but nobody lets it threaten them or stop them from doing their job. A terrorist wants to terrorize, and none of us are going to do that. In the meantime, the Associated Press is reporting Capitol Police have requested that members of the National Guard continue to provide security at the U.S. Capitol for another two months. Defense officials say that the new proposal is being reviewed by the Pentagon. Well, that COVID relief bill making its way through Congress can't come soon enough for some. The number of people filing for first time unemployment benefits went up last week to 745,000. That is 9,000 more than the week before. And then starting next week in Michigan, a new round of people will be eligible to get vaccinated. People 50 and up with certain medical conditions can try to get appointments on Monday. Everyone 50 and up is eligible on the 22nd and we'll get new infection numbers from the state today. But just yesterday, state officials reported 1,536 new cases of COVID-19 and five deaths.